got some more Faust Altrum. In the last one, we finished chapter three, was it? Yes? <laughs> Sorry, I'm like so bad. I've got terrible memory. But yeah, we finished, uh, <gasps> I got the hiccups. We finished chapter three. And uh, so now we're in um, <laughs> chap the final chapter, chapter four. Whatever. <laughs> so, um, apparently this game has multiple endings, right? And, like, so, to get a specific one, you can't do certain things. I don't know. I don't know what I can't do. But, um... Hello. Why is there another bed? Why can't I get in that bed? Is it because... I freaking forget that... There was an extra bed. Yes. There was. Yes. Yes. Okay. Hmm. So, first order of business is to... Apparently, I discovered it. I don't know what it is, but I discovered it. Hello. What is this? Oh, this is... Okay, I thought things would have changed. That's okay. Yeah. No, I don't care about this. Well, that sounds mean, but okay. Nope. Hmm. Sorry if you hear background noise. I apologize in advance for that. So... What exactly have I just... Oh. No. That's spooky. Goodbye. My mom says I can't speak to spookies. Goodbye. Nope. Nope. Okay, so the only reason I came down here is because Siebel, but I don't see Siebel anywhere. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. They want me to go down into the eye room. But. Not entirely sure if that's what I have to do. Oh, hello. There's like shadow people or something. I don't... I don't really know. I'm not going to talk to them. Just yet. Hmm. Lugner all over. Hmm. We're not going to talk to the shadow people. <clears throat> hmm. Oh, hello. This was not here before. 4 September. The chi that child starts randomly drawing all over the walls when she has nothing to do or is left unattended in the room. I could only follow behind her to the best of my ability. I told her that it was fine if we o drew only on paper, so we drew a huge stack of paper. I finished reading the fairy tale to her and also told her my stories and those of everyone around us. She drew a lot of pictures. I organized them into an illustration book. She just doesn't like to talk as much. She's not a bad child. If we all can't enter Marguerite's room, then let me stay outside and play with her. 15 September. Marguerite smiles joyfully, but I'm never sure if this is a good thing for her. It's as if she's forgotten all the distasteful issues concerning the outside world, even her family and herself. She now lives happy, w w lives with that person and the child. I'm happy as long as she's happy, so it's not a feeling of loneliness, but rather a sense of an unease. Where had it gone wrong? She stopped playing the piano recently, so I let the child into the piano room. Although unfamiliar, she still had a wonderful time. Should I pick up the piano as well? Huh. Um... Hmm. I don't have anything on my person. 
Oh, 17 September. I want to discuss Marguerite's illness with that person, but Marguerite noticed. I didn't want her to worry, so I pretended that nothing was going on. Where had it gone wrong? The child said she could already play a complete tune, so she dragged me to listen. It would be great if she could practice it well. P.S. If you are snooping through this diary again, please remember to put it back on my shelf. Okay. Mm. I guess. Oh! Chocolates! That's a lot of chocolate! The candy wrapper was a page torn from a diary. <clears throat> 27th of September. They argued over a doll. As Elizabeth was injured when she fell, we were forced to stop this game of playing house. Hmm. Another wooden piece. Okay. I guess. I, I don't want to talk to, like, the shadow people because I don't know if they're bad or something. I don't know. Hmm. Oh! O-M-G. I now know what these are for. Oh my gosh, it all makes sense now. It all makes sense now. Well, not everything, because I still don't know what the hell she found out, but she found something out. But the thing that makes sense is I have wooden pieces, and I've been wondering what the hell the wooden pieces were for. The wooden pieces are for the kitchen. Because remember, the witch is something... I Wow, this is a lot smaller. It's weird. But yeah, the witch is something. <clears throat> they they all had to equal each col row column and diagonal has to equal 15. And I have three pieces now, which is what I was missing. So, okay, so we have 9 2 7. Okay. So 2 plus 7 is 9. Hmm. But then, like, I have to make sure that... So I would need a 6 there. 8 plus 1 is 9. So 6 would go in the bottom. 9 plus 1 is 10. That's 5. So we need 5 for that. 5 is the only one that goes there. So f 4, 5, 6. Four. Yes. Five. I thought it was like actual like boards we needed to stand on and stuff. But completely forgot that this was a thing. Mm -hmm. A piece of paper had fallen out from behind the puzzle. Oopsie. Uh. Sheet music. Sheet music. Sheet music. Just the child scribbles. Also, my map doesn't matter anymore. Well, I don't exactly... 100% remember where the piano room is. I do believe it's this way. Because, I mean, obvious sheet music, so I, that goes in the piano. This is not the room. That is not the piano room. Well, this one is. Hello. Hello. But do I have a key for that? No. Hmm. Do I need to get a key for the piano room? Uh, where do you get a... Hmm. Is there... How do I get into the piano room? I don't have a key or anything. <sighs> Perhaps she couldn't make any friends because she was talking to it. Hmm. 
I'm missing a key. I have to be missing a key. Because I am not understanding. Like, I think I'm missing a key, but I don't... How do I get in there if I can't... Red, purple, blue. But how do I get into the piano room? I don't understand. It's locked. Do I have to be wearing a dress? Hmm. I don't understand. I obviously have to go in there, but... I don't understand how to get in there. It's not letting me. There has to be something that I'm missing. Because, like, the piano room is locked now. So I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I'm going to pause the recording here and try and figure out what the hell I'm supposed to do. I'll be right back. Hi, so I'm back. Um, so I found a key in the drawer where I got the, in the mirror room. I had to look it up because I was like, I don't understand. The piano room is locked, but I don't have a key. And I don't know where the hell I was supposed to find one. So I looked it up and people were saying that... Oh, the key's in the mirror room. And so I was like, oh, well, that makes sense. I didn't have time to really look for it because after I picked up the rabbit, it was um, kicking me out. So I should have probably looked in the drawer first, but I don't know, whatever. Um, so now we have the key, hopefully, to the piano room. Yep, perfect. Sweet, wonderful. <laughs> All right, so... Hello? Exclamation point at... Okay, so... Exclamation point at money percent times and question. Red... <sighs> hmm... So we have red, purple, blue, teal, yellow, green, and pink. Okay. So red, purple, blue, teal, yellow, green, pink. Okay. So... Okay. So I got a... F okay. So F is pink. G is green. Oh, wait, what? What is... Oh, that's... Um... Say... Oh, that's the I okay sure that's the opening to the um it was nice that that song the the, the opening song to the game a red flower hmm 28th September. It seems that we really can't continue this way. I thought she was dreaming, but the one hiding in a beautiful dream was me. It was I who didn't f dare face a suffering Marguerite. I was too afraid to shoulder the responsibility, and thus chose the easiest method. But this shouldn't have been. But this shouldn't have been that way. My responsibilities were supposed to be helping her return to the real world and not lead the way in escaping reality. To think that I've spent so long to recall such a simple matter. It's time to end this. I should go wake up and leave this place. It's been a long time since I've entered her room, but let's go in still. I should bring flowers. Wake up. Leave in dreams what shouldn't be brought to reality. Hmm. Siebel? Oh. 
Hello, Siebel. Oh. I can't move. Fuck me. Look at him. Look at him go like a champ. Like a champ. Someone giggling? <laughs> Who's giggling? Hello? She opened the door with a familiar voice. Look, what do you think of this ribbon? It's cute, right? Let's bring it with us when we go out next time. Daddy said he'll take us to the beach. That was Marguerite. She just knew that it was Marguerite. The flowers on the shrubs have all bloomed today. Let's go out for a picnic later. No, can't go outside the wall. We find just staying here. That's right, this is just a dream, she thought. Only in dreams will someone help her. Only in dreams will someone talk to her. Only in dreams will she have friends. Only in dreams will she see Marguerite. Ah, ah, it's so warm today. I wish this moment would never end, Elizabeth. She had thought several times that it would be nice to just stay like this and not wake up. But indeed, this could never be. Nothing could progress without waking up. I'm sorry, even though I'm not Elizabeth. She said as the floor swayed to her every uttered sound. She said, Even though I have no way to make all of you like me, although a lot of bad things have happened, but I still wish to return to a world in which all of this exists. She said, I can wake up already. Let me wake you too? Please wake up and look carefully. Everyone knew that at whom he was looking at, the person he was. Who are you? What are you doing here? What have you done with Elizabeth? The sun on her face and outside the window had all disappeared. What are you saying? Why should I leave with you? What have you said to that person? Marguerite's features were a blurry mess. She dragged her stick-thin body heavily forwards with a slow plodding steps accompanied by a cloud of darkness. It's you. It's you. It's you that have caused us to be like this. You always serve titusly uh, I can't say that word talked about me with that person you're always off on the side saying bad things about me to that person the person only listens to you he does anything you ask him to she had finally figured out that Marguerite wasn't talking to herself where had it gone wrong don't you know that person won't look at me as long as you're here why 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 you? Why is there you? That familiar phrase made its way into her ears. If only you weren't here. 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 Do I have to run again? Oh. Flower petals and a cat's corpse. Where had it gone wrong? I could still seem to hear the adults say that. Holy fuck. Oh, wow. So that's a thing. You killed my you killed my cat. You You kind of murdered my cat. Which uh wasn't cool. You know, you don't go murdering people's cats. It's kind of rude. Do I... There's a crying shadow blocked by the door. Maybe something could be given to her to help her pass. 
not in the mood to eat. I'm sorry I didn't let you go inside and play with everyone, she said to her own shadow. Shadow sitting in the rain. I'm sorry I let you stand in the rain, she said to her own shadow. Let me just go back to my original dress. I don't remember where shadows are. I know there's one in Siebel's room. I killed my cat. I'm so sad. God, crap. Walked right into the wall. A shadow with a woolen blanket wrapped around it. No need to light it. It was just a toy. Upon further inspection, the candle holder was just a toy. No. This? Yeah. Here, have the dress. See? I did good changing my clothes. I'm sorry I didn't properly dress you up then, she said to her own shadow. Hmm. So I'm guessing all like the stuff that I have now I'm giving to the shadows. I have no idea where other shadows are. I can't get in that room no more. Oh wait, yes I can. I'm dumb. I just went in there. Oh, hello. Oh, that's not what I wanted to look at. She discovered it. Okay, so... There's no shadow in there. Is there a shadow in here? Nope. Hmm. I'm assuming that I'm nearing the end. No shadow in there. Okay, so there's no more shadows up on the third floor. Um... I know there's some on the second floor. So I'm just gonna skadoodle in here. Yes, hello. A shadow shivering with cold. Maybe there's a way to warm this area up. Something that can be burned needs to be placed inside. Throw the paper inside. Not enough paper to burn, okay. So both of the maps. I'm sorry I didn't let you reach out for help then, she said to her own shadow. Hmm. Any more shadows? Not in here. I'm like terrified. I haven't the slightest clue um, if uh, something's going to happen. <laughs> hmm. Let's check this way. I don't think there's any shadows in here. But I'm just going to do a quick check. Yeah, there was nothing in there when I went in there. Hmm. There was none in Marguerite's room. So, we're just gonna go down to the first floor, I guess? I don't know how many more shadows there are. Like, I don't... I don't know if the shadows only appear in, like, the areas that are, um, paperized. I'm assuming they, they are. Like, the, the, I mean, they do. I'm assuming the shadows only appear where the areas are like paper and stuff, but um <sighs> it doesn't hurt to check. Cause I don't wanna like move on ahead and then Okay. 
So... Okay, can't go that way, all right. Hmm. So, to the right there were no shadows because I went into those rooms. I'm assuming we're going down. Yeah, I guess. I'm not entirely sure, but um, I suppose. Oh, hello. It was locked. There was wide open key. A wide open eye. Wide open eye. Where did... Hmm. I don't have a key for that. Like... I don't... How can I help if I don't have a key for that? go obviously I need to get the key for that guy but I don't know where I can find that um, time to look it up again because um, <laughs> like knowing my luck there's gonna be Um, an issue if I don't do that I won't be able to beat the game so I will pause the recording and be right back so I looked up something and they were like overturned the inner tube and so I came to do that and so that's what I was like oh bring back the recording let's go to the real beach after waking up from here she thought something fell down from overhead metallic key oh perfect that's the key that I need actually wonderful uh sorry uh, um, so this, I have a feeling this uh, episode is going to be super long because I'm pretty sure this is going to be the last part of it. So, um, yeah, this is, this is fine. I'm not a hundred percent sure what I have to do. But, um, give it to her. Mm -hmm. go what Elizabeth do I have to run darkness oozed out oh I'm assuming I gotta run is it from my uh, my buddy Mephisto M where are you where are you going there was light all around, but that patch of darkness was so deep that the bottom couldn't be seen. Where are you going? It was like a coating of sugar had been mel completely melted. Where are you going? I've changed his voice so many times that she had already remembered. About this place, about herself, and she had remembered everything about that thing. Nope. Mama said, I can't play with you anymore. 
but the dream didn't wish to end, and it asked in a sharp voice, Where are you going? I'm just running. Mm -mm. I'm just running. I'm going. I'm going. You can't stop me. Nope. 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 Goodbye. I've got places to go and people to see. Goodbye. Goodbye. I'm running. Hello. I fell down. Oh no. Must run quickly. Must run quickly. Must run quickly. But she lifted her head to find that the world was an expanse of black. No matches, no light, no people. The darkness was so uncompromisingly thick and opaque that it was like it would swallow someone whole. Where was the door? To the front? In the back? She started losing track of direction and fell to a sitting position on the ground. The blackness slow started slowly eating away at her. So tired. Really want to sleep. Really... Come this way. Pardon me. Oh good, are you awake? Sorry, but you'll catch a cold if you fall asleep here. Do you live nearby? Is that so? I haven't come back here for many years as well. Sorry, nothing much, just that I've heard that this house will be cleaned up. Ah, my apologies, hello. I was a nurse who used to work here, just that. I think there was a piano in the house. I hope the new owner can avoid throwing it away. It's not worth a lot, and it's quite old. It may have been left there for a long time without a tune-up. It's nothing important. Mm? No, I don't play. It's just that before... Hmm? What? Mm. It was a long time ago. I don't remember much of it. Where to begin? Wow, this game <laughs> was so good. I'm not entirely sure what ending I got. I'll probably look in like the guides and see what I got. I think this is the hidden ending. Um, but I'm not in like, so I'm I'm confused. I don't know what she found out. Maybe in the true ending you find out. Maybe eventually I'll replay this later on and like try and get the true ending or something. But I don't know what she found out, like, okay, so everything was a dream, which was easy enough to tell, but, like, who, if she said she wasn't Elizabeth, then who was she, you know? Sorry, I was taking a drink. Then, like, who was she if she wasn't Elizabeth? Like, I feel like I don't really have enough of an idea, like, like, so I'm going to assume that the house that she was in wasn't really a house. It was more of a... An asylum, I guess? Not like just a mental asylum, but like an asylum for... Anything, because it seems like those three kids were also there. Like, it's not really a hospital, but, you know kind of has those traits i don't know maybe it was a mental asylum i'm not entirely sure but i don't know it's it's strange it's it really is strange so like marguerite was there i don't know if elizabeth had a sister because the room that was hers had two beds so i don't know if like elizabeth had a sister and elizabeth was the one that got all the attention or if like Marguerite was actually her mom and if Marguerite wasn't her sister or something or like because Marguerite was talking to a doll that she named Elizabeth and the person we've been playing as who we thought was Elizabeth says that they weren't Elizabeth so like it's so it's so weird 
but like the game itself is was so good like i'm i'm wondering if like it the true end will in fact like tell us what she found out you know because i don't think this is the true end because i'm still left with some questions you know Siebel is obviously the nurse that worked there and maybe he had a thing for Marguerite or something and like he saw Marguerite was never really getting well so he kind of took responsibility of raising Elizabeth maybe I'm not entirely sure it's it's so strange but the game was so good oh my gosh I really enjoyed it yep hidden ending song of flowers I really wish I knew what the hell, like, the truth was. Like, maybe the thing that she found out was just that... Was just that she, um... It was a dream and she wasn't really Elizabeth. You can view the special bonus for those who finished the game, this game an extra now. Let's check out those bonuses then. Well, these are just, like, um... The pretty images. Yeah, so these are ones that I'm assuming. So like in hide in the hide and seek section, I know there was another place I could hide. You get a different CG for that, I guess. I'm assuming these are CGs for something else. Wow, there's a lot of them. I didn't I missed the story. I missed one for Pinocchio as well. Hmm. Well then. I... <laughs> I guess maybe one day I'll go back in and uh, not record the whole game because this game was relatively long, but, you know, record up to a certain part and be like, okay, so this is something different and just like constantly have the th like just like it won't be a full like me playing through it'll probably be like little bits and pieces of things that I'm finding new maybe I'll just end up doing that or maybe I'll leave it as this and you know call it a day I don't know I I kind of wish I knew more but I, I got kind of an idea of what was happening wow <sighs> It was a really good game, though. Um, so now I've got to figure out what I'm going to be playing next. I might be doing another long game, which um, part of me doesn't really want to do that because I'm already doing Life is Strange, and that game is going to be relatively long. And I kind of want to have like um, games that aren't long with games that are long you know stuff like that so I'm not into oh excuse me that was gross I'm not entirely sure what the next game I'll be playing is I was thinking I was gonna play through Danganronpa since the third game is going to be coming out although I don't have the second one on Steam yet but um I do have the first one and I eventually <clears throat> eventually do want to get the second and third one and the other one on Steam, so maybe some time in the future I'll do that. But yeah, I was planning maybe Danganronpa. But um, we'll see, we'll see. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I sincerely appreciate it. I really hope you guys enjoyed the playthrough of Faust Alptrum. I know I it was kind of slow at some points because I'm like bad at puzzles, but um, it really means a lot that you guys stuck through. <laughs> But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it, and um, I guess I'll see you in the next one. Bye!